hello. Yep. Another oil farm. Yeah, I'm somewhere in uh, in central West Texas. Well, hello, Kristen. How are you? Let's have some hearts. Thank you. Yeah, I'm starting to to, to count them up. It's starting to get to be a substantial number. Wow. So uh, anyway, here I am on uh, the second of the two legs of my journey on far. Uh, that's uh, city and rural rides in uh, in. Texas, uh, west of uh, Palo Pinto County, and uh, I think through Mitchell County. So I'm getting dropped off. Uh, well, we're going to drop it, it, drop off. Uh, the, my driver David here is from Sweetwater, and he knows a place where I can pick up some uh, uh, some raw burgers uh, to cook over a campfire tonight. I'll put my scoutmaster skills to work, and finally uh, take that. Uh, that pup tent off my back and uh, spread it out and sleep under some stars tonight. So looking forward to that. And in the morning, uh, Spartan Transit. What do I want for Christmas? Uh, don't give it much thought, being Jewish, but uh, that is a very, uh, very, very kind thing to, to ask me. I guess a, a, a plane ticket from San Francisco back to New York would be a great Christmas present if, if you're thinking of me and uh, we're looking for something a little less expensive. What's the worst present you ever received? Okay, listen. I'm a suburban work daddy. So the, the worst present I received is like that tenth pair of socks when everyone's exchanging presents and uh, extended relatives on, um, on the Christian side of my family don't know what to get me. Uh, so they get me socks. I get ties, I get socks, I get a lot of that. Um, so, yeah, an another pair of socks is probably the, the worst Christmas present I ever got. Who is my first celebrity crush? That's an easy one. Julie Newmar, the Catwoman. I, I, I was uh, like six or seven years old. I didn't know what was going on down uh, below my elastic waistband. But something weird was happening every time uh, Julie Newmar was on the screen. That's an easy question. <laughs> First celebrity crush. All right, so. Um, what was the first record I ever bought? David Bowie, Rebel Rebel. Why are you asking me these questions? I'm, I'm not ashamed to answer any of them. But uh, it's, they're bizarre questions. Oh fuck, are, oh, fuck are you fat boy? Oh, fuck, do you have your, uh, your internet muscles on, kid? Believe me, I can kick your ass and kick your daddy's ass and wear you two like a pair of loafers. Do not fuck with me. What in life am I most proud of? Uh... Well, I, I think it's just um, that I've overcome a lot to accomplish a lot. Um, I think resilience is a, is a trait I have of which I'm most proud. So uh, it, it, it's, it's helped me along. I, I've done a number of things. I've, I've uh, gotten an MBA. I, uh, I, I stood up and was counted. Uh, during the, the Gulf War. I was a civilian volunteer on the Israeli Defense Forces Armored Cavalry Base. I was very proud of having done that. I'm very proud of, uh, of being um, a, a, a husband and father and uh, you know, 15 years at IBM. You know, not, none, of this, uh, you know, none of this came easy. Uh, served as executor for my mother's uh, uh, estate. Um, regrets? Millions of them. I, w I can't go through them all. Lots of regrets. It's, it's, it's called living life. Uh, okay, so uh, one thing I do, I have seen more and more hagglers on scope. 
Are you driving the bus? No, I'm leaving that to the pros. There's a gentleman uh, about uh, eight feet in front of me named David who knows how to drive a bus. I do not know how to drive a bus. So uh, I'm going to, like I said, leave it to the pros. Who from your childhood do you miss the most? Um, the people I miss most from my childhood I'm actually getting reacquainted with on this trip, so it's really not a... Not a fair question. Uh, how am I paying for this? Um, I have a GoFundMe campaign. Uh, there's a you, you can uh, donate if, uh, to a GoFundMe campaign for the Cross Country Local, and um, I also uh, have a corporate underwriter called uh, Echo Lane, and they do scheduling software for paratransit and uh, they've been most generous and uh, I, I count on their continued generosity. Also, when all this is over, um, I hope to have a book deal with somebody because, bang, this is something nobody's even thought of doing before. Uh, so, uh, yeah, the ne next stop is David's hometown of Sweetwater, Texas, where I go to, uh, to a store and pick up some, uh, some vittles for tonight, which I intend to cook over a campfire. And then in the morning, Spartan Transit is taking me to Big Spring, Texas, and handing me off to uh, West Texas Opportunities Tracks, which is taking me to Midland, and Easy Rider is taking me into um, Odessa, Friday afternoon, Friday evening. Odessa peeps through Periscope. We are on for this weekend. Spread the word. Um, uh, yeah, uh, Gothic Barbie, uh, 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 three men, one walk, three guys, one mic, um, uh, Young C, uh, Forrester. Let's do it this weekend. Let's party on. And uh, you got to show me your town. And uh, so, so look forward to an epic scope this weekend out of Odessa, Texas. We are, you know, the tribe is going to gather and we are, we are going to do something crazy it is on for this weekend. Um, so anyway, that's uh, that's about it. Uh, again, thank you for asking about the funding. If you care to kick in, oh, count on it, Kristen. Count on it. We are definitely going to scope it. Uh, it'll probably be scoped like three, four different directions. It'll it'll, it'll be like uh, cinema scope. <laughs> anyway. Um, if you care to contribute to the Cross Country Local, there is a, a, a Cross Country Local campaign on GoFundMe. Please uh, kick in a few bucks if you can. Um, one thing I definitely need is exact change, so no donations too small. Uh, secondly, uh, follow me here on Periscope. And if you already follow me, take a minute and share this with your friends and invite them to follow me on Periscope. Um, you can also follow the Cross Country Local on the, the public page on Facebook and hashtag we're passing horsies. Say hi to the horsies. Those horsies is that cattle. I don't know. This is Texas. We go anyway. <laughs> if, if this was Germany, there'd be Jews in there. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> All right. So uh, anyway. Um, you can follow along on uh, Twitter and Instagram, hashtag XC Local. That's X Ray Charlie Local for Cross Country Local. And um, that's it for now. I will uh, I'll talk to you in, uh, later at the campfire. Uh, in the meantime, see you along the route.